Final round highlights from the Web.com Tours Midwest Classic held at the Nicholas Golf Club at Lions Gate in Overland Park, Kansas. Starting off on the third hole, it's Bronson Burgoon finds himself in the greenside bunker. Take a look at this. Tries to avoid getting sand in his face. Turns around just in time to see that beautiful shot as he was going to tap in for birdie. Jared Lyle, of course, the great story of this week. Maybe this year, two-time cancer survivor making his debut back in the States after successfully defeating leukemia for the second time in his life. Lyle would go on to finish at 11 under par. T11, an amazing story, an incredible performance from Jared Lyle this week. Bill Lundy now sitting at 11 under at this point. This for Eagle on the 13th as he drains a huge bomb there to jump to 13 under par. He was all over the board, had a double on the second, an eagle right there, would finish off with a two under 69, 15 under overall. Aaron Watkins, he began the day at 17 under, so trying to chase down Zach Sucher, who held the lead heading into Sunday. This was his third shot, giving himself a nice look here at birdie to get back to 17 under par. He was one over on his day to this point, curls it in, gets back to even, but would finish one over on the day at 16 under. Leaving the floor wide open for Zach Sucher, University of Alabama, Birmingham alum. He struggled early, started with two bogeys on the day, made the turn, then went on to bogey 10 and 11 as well. This though, on the 13th, an absolutely beautiful third shot. Tap in for Burry there to move it to 18 under par, and he would distance himself with a couple birdies heading in. And then this on the 18th, he has two putts for the win. Lags it up there, gives himself about three feet here for par to finish at 19 under par. Overall, Zach Sucher wins by three to improve the fourth on the money list. You will be seeing him on the PGA Tour next year thanks to his first Web.com Tour victory here at the Midwest Classic.